Why does Apple not allow screen recorders? Let's ask them. Hello folks and welcome back to the Video Gadgets channel. I get a hell of a lot of comments on my videos. The majority of them at the moment tend to be about VGJ Rec, but in between those, I get some pretty sensible questions. One of which is a recurring one and has been for months and months and months. And that is, why does Apple hate screen recorders? We've never had an official screen recorder on an iOS device. There's never been an unofficial one on the App Store or when they have appeared on the App Store, they've immediately been revoked or chucked off of the App Store. So it's clear that Apple doesn't want us recording our screens. Now they've never given out an official answer to this, so I decided to take things into my own hands. Now, I didn't go and walk into an Apple store and ask because they probably would have thrown me out, especially if I brought my mascot with me. So what I did is go onto the Apple online chat and try to find out that way. And this is how it went down. Now this very first exchange felt like I was talking to a computer uh, since it didn't really ask me any specific questions and it was looking for probably trigger points such as product names, refund or whatever. But soon enough I was connected to somebody with a slightly quirky name. Is it Natasha, Natasha, Nastasia with two S's? I don't know, I'm probably going to get absolutely flamed in the comments for that one. But anyway, we're digressing. I am now connected to my Apple specialist. So I decided to go straight for the jugular. I basically asked them, I want to record my screen for when I'm playing games. And the idea was that I was going to pitch this as a determining factor on whether I bought an iOS device or an Android device. And that's going to come up a little later. So let's see what she says. Okay, she's going to check if there are any apps available for this. No, 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 hang on, hang on. I've got a better meme for this. All right, let's play devil's advocate here for a second. These Apple specialists probably get hundreds of questions a day about many different parts of a product. You can't expect them to remember everything off by heart. And let's be honest, how many people who actually own Apple devices want to screen record? Maybe 2%, 5% at a complete guess. But she had put the seed of optimism in my head. So I thought I'd really drill home the question to see what came back. And their response did take quite a while, probably about a minute. So I think she probably went off and asked somebody else for an answer or maybe searched their knowledge base and they finally came back with this. Ah, so it's not natively built into the Apple device, but there may be third party applications. Yes, we already know this, but why do they not appear on the App Store? But since the question of whether you could natively record it on your iOS device came up, I thought I'd make a little dig at Apple and ask a dumb question. Ah, huh. I thought you would be able to screen record on your device because it's 2017. And here was a response. And this is the first big barrier that we're getting from Apple. They say that you can screen record, but you have to stream it to your Mac or your PC through QuickTime in order to do it. Ah, my first trap. I know that you definitely can't do it to a PC using QuickTime because QuickTime has been de-supported completely on PCs as of a couple of years ago, as I believe it. So I thought I'd uh, ram home my knowledge about this not being possible. And even if it is possible to stream it, your iOS device to your PC or your Mac, which we know we can do, how many people can do that of the 2-5% to that want to screen record? Obviously we're lowering the user base even more. And there we are, correction made, apology offered, apology accepted. But we need to get back on track anyway. So I'm going to say that I don't have a Mac, which is completely true, but I do have a PC. And if you've been watching my videos over the last six months, you will know that you can uh, stream your iOS device to your PC and record it using Lonely Screen, which is completely free. Check out the video if you want to. So I'm going to ask them and say, you can't record your iOS screen directly from your iPhone or your iPad. And this was their suggestion. You could take a screenshot. Eh? 
Let's pretend our Apple specialist never suggested such an idea and we'll never speak of it again. So let's move on to the second phase of this conversation. We now know and Apple admit that they don't do screen recording natively on their iOS devices. So I was going to drop the bombshell. This is a deal breaker for me. I'm thinking of getting an Apple or an Android device. Screen recording is very important to me and lots of applications on Android do it for free. So why doesn't an Apple iOS device do that? And this was the specialist response. And there you have it folks, the average man or woman in an Apple store, over the telephone, on online chat, is not going to be able to answer your question about why iOS devices do not screen record. They don't have specific answers to specific questions. And they have the fallback of sending you to the feedback section of Apple. And when you think about it, how many people have probably gone to the feedback section of Apple and asked for screen recording, probably tens of thousands, and nobody, we guess, has ever had a straight answer or it's been implemented by Apple, as we now find ourselves in this situation 10 years after the device was released. Now, in order to keep up the charade that I knew nothing about iOS screen recorders and I was asking all this for the first time, I did sound a little annoyed in my messaging. The Apple specialist had mentioned this privacy issue that that's possibly the reason why you might not be able to record on your iOS device. However, they had previously said that we can do screen recording via a MacBook, so surely streaming your iOS device to a MacBook and then screen recording is exactly the same, if not less secure, than doing it directly on your device. So I brought up that, but I hit a brick wall again. They were now saying, we understand your concerns, but you really do need to go back to the feedback section of Apple in order to lodge your, I guess, complaint or suggestion. So effectively, we've hit a big, bad brick wall. Hello? Hello, can anyone hear me? Hello? At this point, there was nothing but to go into full on whinge mode and complain that everybody wants to do gaming on their Apple devices and put it on YouTube, but that kind of fell on deaf ears. In fact, I think the specialist got a little bored at this point and said, yeah, 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 have you got any other complaints? And I said, I guess not because you can't do this. And then, hell. Did they just cut me off? Why you little... So there you have it folks, at the ground level, if you try and ask Apple, the largest company in the world, why they don't have a particular feature on their devices, you're not going to get a straight answer. I'd love to hear your experiences of contacting Apple regarding iOS screen recording, have you heard any different? And if you have any imaginative ways of contacting Apple to try and get a straight answer, other than asking this chap, then let me know. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Thank you very much for watching. A slight deviation from what I usually do, but I thought you might find it interesting. And if you want more iOS screen recording content, then you definitely need to subscribe to the Video Gadgets Journal. Enjoy the rest of your tech day. Bye for now. And if you've been wondering about this t-shirt, it says, I use this t-shirt periodically, which is really funny. The one problem is we've got some green here. So when I turn the green screen on, it looks like I've been shot through the chest.